We're learning more about a pop-up rapid testing company called Center for COVID Control, which is now facing several investigations. Fox News Amelia McGovero reported on the company last night, and she joins us now with what she's learned tonight. Amelia. Yeah, just in the past several hours, the Center of COVID Control did release a statement saying they're pausing all operations for the time being to look for, quote, additional staff. And that includes the testing site here at the Ballpark Village, which was run by the Center for COVID Control. But I did some digging into the company today and, quite frankly, has more questions than answers. I thought it was a bit sketchy. Liz Gerard is one of the many people questioning these pop up testing sites run by the private company Center for COVID Control. The company is based out of Chicago and has about 300 sites across the nation, including three sites in St. Louis City and two in the county. For the past few weeks, complaints have been flooding in about the site's questionable testing protocols. Gerard says she never even got her results. And I waited and, and heard nothing back. And the lady was like doing two tests at a time on people. Like I'm just really upset and like devastated because I told so many people thinking that it was a good resource to get like a free COVID test. Thank you for calling the Center for COVID Control. So today I started with a phone call to the Center of COVID Control and the person who answered my call told me to send an email. Is there any way I can get a hold of your press secretary or Whoever no, takes. No, ma'am, unfortunately, that is the process. So I sent an email and kept digging. I found the company sends the rapid test through a lab called Doctors Clinical Laboratories. The lab takes patients' information and then sends the test results. The lab is certified online under the U.S. government, but when I called the number. Thank you for calling Center for COVID Control, the nation's leader in COVID testing. It's the Center for COVID Control and goes back to that company. I contacted both the Missouri and Illinois Departments of Health, and both say they don't regulate private testing businesses like CCC, but they do monitor and investigate testing labs. The Illinois Attorney General is now investigating the company, along with Oregon's Department of Justice. Gerard says she gave her insurance and license number to the company and is now worried. I'm definitely going to watch my credit report. Um, I and make sure there's no accounts opened in my name. Now the CCC in that release says it plans to reopen its operations January 22nd, but I spoke to the administrator who oversaw the sites here in Ballpark Village, Central West End, as well as Chesterfield, and he says he's currently looking for another vendor, not the CCC, to run those sites in hopes to reopen those sites come next week. Live in St. Louis, Amelia McGalvero, Fox 2 News.